Hey, what's up everybody? How you doing? Welcome back to Carpo Gaming and another Elden Ring video. Today we have a brand new way where you can get millions of runes per hour right here in a brand new spot all the way at the mountaintops of the Giants. Yeah, it's going to be a good one, ladies and gentlemen. Once again, thanks for watching, everybody. Without further ado, ladies and gentlemen, let's just jump right into it. I know your time is short. We over here at the Giant Grave Outpost. It's going to be a new spot, too. So let's do this. Now, from the very first steps, how do you get there? You need to go through the very first boss area, which is rather challenging if you are new. Either do that, or you can cut around the back inside to Eastern Lornia Lakes. Then head over to the mountaintops. There's some steps that you can take down. Head down there to the Eastern Riot Gate and then make your way to the Grand Lift of Dexter's World. So see a video pop up right there. It's how you can get both of the different sides to the Grand Lift of Dexter's. Put those together and open it up and bring it to the Altius Plateau. Then from there, you need to make your way into Lindell Capital City and then through the Western Gate. This may take you some time if it's your first time. Then you'll be at the Forbidden Lands. And from the Forbidden Lands, you want to make your way to the Grand Lift of Roll. Take that bad boy up and now we're going to make our way all the way to this farming spot right here, the giant graves post. Of course, you always want to bring yourself a golden scarab so you can get the most amount of rooms. Also use a golden foul foot if you have it. Now, of course, this is a spot that we have been here before, but this is also a brand new spot. This is like the old spot you used to just jump off the edge over there, but we're going to a new spot right over here on top of this. Maybe a little bit easier for you guys and you never know when things are going to get patched so let's do this first i'm going to show you the wrong way of jumping off because a lot of people have hit me up and say yo i tried it i died and look i know i get it you know if you just come over here and just run and jump and think everything is cool double jumping and swinging and you're dead right so yeah you don't want that to happen so I'm going to show you the correct way of doing this and it's going to be rather simple, although it is just a basically a tweak of the controller, just a little movement to the right, you know, old spot right here. We're not about that life. We are about doing this over here. Let's do this, baby. Now, what you're going to do is basically hop on a rock over here and double jump on the other rock. Pretty basically simple and straightforward, right? Now, here's the thing, this little ledge, you wanna point out to the right just a little bit. So just turn your camera over to the right, okay? Now, as a second reference point, so I'll get you a little point right over there by that wall. Just jump towards that wall and you're good to go, all right? So just, just don't jump out and just start swinging your sword. And you have to make sure you're at the right angle. Why? I have no idea. Maybe I'm thinking it's the rocks that are down there and you not breaking through the rocks or something like that. You just can't see it because you can't really turn the camera angle or anything while you're doing this. Some of the different farming areas that we do this, you can, but this is one of the areas where you can't. So, you know, I'm thinking that's probably what it is. Now, after that, make sure you continually to swing your sword. Reason why you don't want yourself to die. And trust me, if you stop, you will. <laughs> so continue to swing your sword and you're good to go. Now it's going to take you about a minute and a half before the runes pop up. But this is a cool thing about this one. You're going to get rune drops three different times. So you're going to get a large amount and then two smaller amounts of runes. And that's what we're about to see in about 10 seconds. So it does take a little time for it to pop up. But hey, if you want a new farming spot and you know there's always new ones to try out. And go ahead and try this one out so bam there is the first initial boost of runes like so bam and then here comes the second one coming and then we're going to have a third one and just like that after you're done wash rinse repeat head back over to that saving grace point and do it all over again of course there can be more runes if you're doing a new game plus one or two make sure you use that lovely golden scarab and uh yeah have a good time out there but for right now, that's pretty much going to for the video. I hope you truly enjoyed it. As always, if you are new to the channel, how you doing and welcome. Don't forget to subscribe right here at Carpo Gamer for a wide variety of videos, ranging from updates, tips and tricks, guys and news, and a whole lot more. So hopefully you enjoyed this video. Once again, thank you everybody for all your love and support. And as always, I'll be seeing y'all in the next one. Later.